Hello, my dear Bryson. Who knows their name, my dear? Hey! <laughs> Say hello, everybody. Guess what? Three months old. Yeah. So hey guys, um, this is my video of me swinging, and to talk to you about what's been going on in my life. Cause you know, oh yeah, I have such a wonderful life. It's uh, <laughs> yeah, it's pretty awesome. Um, but you know, I've been growing and I'm, I'm three months old. Yeah. Hello, my dear Bryson. Who knows their name, my dear? <laughs> Say hello, everybody. Guess what? I'm three months old. Yeah. Hey. Mama's wingman. Look at you and all your head control and stuff. You're so good. Yes, you've been so good. Hey, hello, world. This is Bryson's. What? Oh my god. This is gonna be like his three, four month update because he is gonna be four months old in like eight days. What? What? You guys are so big, so fast. They grow up so fast, so I like, I try to cherish every moment. Yes. <laughs> um, where do we begin? Oh my gosh. I wrote some stuff down. Let me get that. <laughs> He's so active. Okay, so today we're do his three slash four month update because he'll be four months in like eight days. Um, I am. We are gonna do this in our bed because it's Saturday and we've had a busy morning. We went to the gym. He went with me. He was so good. And then we went to an arts craft festival downtown. So that he could see different things. We're just gonna have a lazy rest of the day. So what's been going on? Bryson, are you gonna tell him? Tell him, babe. Tell him. He's been talking and cooing. I think you guys can you've heard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You just all over the place. Talking talking about stuff. You just gossiping. Baby gossip. <laughs> I love to come home and hear what he has to say. And he's got stories, stories for days. He learned how to roll over on April 1st. He did his first rolling over. And luckily my mother-in-law who watches him Tuesday through Friday caught it, his first legit attempt on video. and sent it to me while I was at work and I freaked out and started crying. <laughs> I didn't start crying, but I like teared up. I was so excited. Um, so he did that and I, when I came home, he uh, rolled over a couple of times. Anytime he's like on his back, he's trying to roll over. And that night actually, the night of April Fools or the March 31st, I noticed that he was switching back and forth in his bed at night, practicing like in his sleep. So I just knew he was going to do it really soon. So he's doing that. Um, he's super alert, as you guys can tell. He's definitely curious about his surroundings, and that's why I like taking him out places. Um, he knows who his mother and his papa are. Yes, because when I come home from work and I say, Bryson, and he's looking for me, and when he sees me, he starts smiling. 
Yes, you do. These are smiling and giggling because you love me. You love me so much. Um, let's see. He's starting to reach out to you when he's like, come on, let's go. And he'll reach his arms out, like, okay, let's go, pick me up. <laughs> uh, he loves books, he loves to read. He, he thinks it's funny when I'm dancing. He likes to, he likes music and he likes to hear you sing. He likes uh, to watch. Are you watching and you're learning? So it's really important to watch what you're doing around kids. They soak all this stuff up. They do. I think I mentioned this before, but he's super giggly and happy in the morning. He's still that way, thank God. Yes, yes you are. He was sleeping six to seven hours straight at night, but I think he's going through some teething situations. So he's waking up every three to four hours again. Um, and he is really not taking naps during the day. And um, he'll take like short naps, like 20 minute naps, 20 to 30 minutes. But that's only if you're like, after he eats or um, if it's a car ride, he'll be napping. But as soon as we put him, take him in the house, or we move to put him down, he wakes back up. So we need to figure out a napping situation because he's not taking naps and he needs naps. You need naps, baby. You do. As you can tell, his hair is getting a lot more curly. It's just, it's just curly for days. He's got really curly hair now. His eyes are still kind of blue gray. I feel like Mason thinks they're turning, but they're still like blue gray. He loves to sit up and look around. He's sitting up right now, pretty much on his own. Aren't you? He's got good head control. Yeah. Say what's up? What's up, people? <laughs> he likes his stroller and going for walks. Don't you? Mm -hmm. He's still breastfed. That's still going well. Even though I feel like I should be producing way more every two to three hours, but I'm assuming it's enough for him. Yeah. It could be all just in my head though, cause you know, as women we like to uh, doubt ourselves a lot. But uh, he's growing. We have a doctor's appointment for him on, on the April the 11th. So we'll get to see exactly how much he weighs. When I like weigh him on our scale, it comes out to around 11 pounds. And, but we shall see exactly on April 11th. Okay, he's in size two diapers and he's definitely fitting his three month old clothing real snug. So he is like one of those kids who he is going he fits into the clothes as their size. So newborns, he was fitting into them perfectly. One month, now he's into three month clothing. So whatever the clothing says, that's, he'll fit it. He'll fit it at that age, if you know what I mean. I hope I'm making sense, yeah. But yeah, that's pretty much um, the main things that's been going on with my little bushki. My little baby cakes. <laughs> okay, so as far as me, what's going on with mama? Nothing much. 
Oh, I have, um, I am experienced postpartum shedding and my hair has been in a bun most days. So I don't even really like dealing with my hair. It's really, 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 really tangly more so than it used to be. Uh, I've tried. I, I gave myself a trim. I gave myself a protein treatment. I try to do deep conditioning every week and washing my hair every week. But it's still just a hassle to deal with. So it stays in this messy bun. I need to wash my hair today. But I'm by myself right now. So it's kind of difficult to tend to my hair while I have him by myself. Um... I'm still getting my body. Well, my body is pretty much back to how it was. I feel like my body is way better now after baby than it was before. I have curves that I didn't have before. Um, I posted on my Instagram like a picture of kind of where I'm at right now. Everything's been going great. Uh, my body is pretty much back to normal. I'm having my regular cycles again, all that jazz. Um, oh, I have experienced um, super dry skin to the point where now I have eczema flares and I didn't know what it was. It was like some type of, I thought it was a rash and I went to the doctor and it, it was eczema. So they gave me some cream to put on it and now it's going back to normal. It was, it's in my arm where you see, yeah, it was really bad. It's getting better though and I had on my neck. So I had to put it on my neck and on my arm. Uh, yeah, that's it. So I will leave this vlog at this. All right. We'll figure out what's wrong with you. <laughs> Probably wants to eat. All right, guys. That's his update. He's doing so well. I'm so I'm such a proud mom. Such a proud mom. You're doing so well. Now you just gotta get your nap down. You can get that nap down. Oh, and I think he's teething because he's drooling a whole lot. And that probably has to do with him being somewhat restless at night and waking up every three to four hours as well. Gross spurt teething. Yeah. All right, guys. Bye. And bye.